just, uh, I'm talking to a young lady who said she was out here on the worst night, and I've she's been, been out here so far. Nights, that... This is the best night. Tell, tell me about uh, how you feel. How do you feel now uh, between the first night, the worst night, I'll say, and now your best uh, dish night? Well, yeah. the worst night I've had was when I was tear gas, smoke bomb. I'm going to just say the very first night I was out here was when Ferguson police was still taking over yeah. before the troopers even came in. And that was like one of the worst days when the protests had just started. Um, this was like the day after the first looting, when the protests had just started, the way, and started, the, like pe the Ferguson police was out here with their tank trucks and rubber bullet guns and stuff. And I'm like, all we're doing is protesting peacefully. It just started, you know, and they've already treated us like we're criminals. I really didn't appreciate that. You're not the first one that I've heard that from, too. Yeah. They had no reason to start getting aggressive. Yes, yes. So, and it feels good to be able to smile tonight. Exactly. This wow. is the best night I've had. That's so the last time I was here a couple of days ago, I wasn't too happy. I was highly pissed. But this is the best night I've had. Mm -hmm. You know, I am proud of every officer that took part in making this a very peaceful protest. Great. Great. Yes. I hope it continues to stay like this. Every day. You want to tell I us who you are? Fingers crossed. Yeah, me too. And I got my hands up in prayer too. So. <laughs> me too. Yeah. Uh, bless you. Yeah. You want to tell everybody who you are? Uh, I'm Stephanie Taylor. Okay. Uh, Sync social work major. Okay. A senior um, at UMSO. Um, even I'm not from Ferguson, I'm from Jennings, but okay. even though I live about five miles from Ferguson, I still feel like I'm a part of this community right. being so close. We all know? should. We all should. Police brutality and it's not just a Ferguson thing, it's a national thing. Yeah. And in my personal belief, I believe when injustice occurs in one community, all communities need to come together. No community should be shut out. If communities want to come together, all communities should be welcome That's to right. come and protest peacefully. Not cause trouble, but peacefully. I agree. So, Thank you so much. You're